What's going on guys, No Slack Novak here with episode 2 of our Project High Rise Las Vegas DLC. Episode 1 got rave reviews, lots of likes, good positive comments, so uh, I decided let, let's make it a series, let's keep going with it. Now we are kind of struggling for cash, we only have 674, but we are making a decent amount of money because our, our hotel rooms are doing a pretty decent job of generating revenue. Offices, not so much. I mean, they're kind of keeping us afloat. Uh, we have the one little uh, bagel shop here, which is only making about 79 uh, bucks a day. But as these guys leave their rooms, we're getting a nice chunk of change. Every time the hotel people leave, we get something like 140 bucks. And then our housekeeping goes through, fixes this little mess you see here. If we zoom in, uh, for some reason, they threw something up against the wall got liquor here on the bottom we got the you know nasty wet stains on the bed I mean that's disgusting but hey that's what housekeeping's for that's what we pay them the small bucks for to clean that stuff for us so that we can just re-rent those rooms uh, later uh, tonight now I'm thinking with with, um, with the hotels making us with the rooms making us so much money I'm thinking we want to just build another floor of just hotel rooms. Now let's check here. I don't want to do apartments. I don't want to. Well, I think we should have to do. Well, we don't have to do anything. But I'm thinking we want to do at least one retail store. I'm thinking that's something we might want to actually do. Let's uh, let's expand our our bottom floor a little bit. And then let's try to put a retail shop down. We have enough money, I think, to where we can do that. Twelve hundred bucks should be more than enough. Just one. I think I just want to test it out. Just see how that goes. One retail store. Not get too crazy with it. Let's put that right there, right next to the concierge. And then let's see what our options here are. Food and beverage, portable electronics, books, news, magazine, drugstore, flower. Wine and spirits, souvenir shops. Man, we have a lot of a uh, lot of options here. This is pretty sweet. Now I'm sure some of them, yeah, some of them don't want to come. Storeroom, one empty bay required. Storeroom, storeroom, um, storeroom. So it looks like we need a storeroom, <laughs> pretty clearly, right? So we need a storeroom. However, I do not know what a storeroom is. So let's see. Um. Artwork, no. Decorative elements, no. Build services to support. Uh, offices, no. Apartment dwellers, no. Build services required by hotel guests. Nope, that's not it. Tower dwellers, happy. No, we don't need that right now. Hmm. Storeroom. Nothing here. I don't think it's going to be under offices either. File storage, no, 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 no. Where, oh, where? Building staff, maintenance office, no. Movers office, hmm, I don't think there's any need for that right now. Storage, aha. Provides four storage bays for retail storage. Each, oh, wow, each retail tenant requires one storage bay. Wow, okay, so that's something we're going to have to really kind of focus on. I'm thinking we should probably go down into the basement just a little bit more now. Hmm. Alright, let's, um... We only have 1,206 bucks. Let's just do the one. Let's try this out. We're going to do the one. We'll extend out this way, and then uh, let's speed up time. And then the store bay was over here. Storage. Let's see. Oh, that's a big thing. Okay. So we need to come out just a little bit more. We need to come out about the yay far. Storage. Bam. We need one of those per each retail store? That's pretty crazy. That seems like a really huge... I don't know, that just doesn't seem right to me, but okay. Well, we'll give it a shot. Portable, portable electronics, uh, books, news, magazines, drugstore, flower store, wine and spirits, souvenir shops. 
I'm thinking. Okay, let's see. Who's going to pay us the most? 200. Right around 200. Same thing there. Drugs. Ooh, drugstore. 270. One empty bay required. It needs an electrical line and a phone line. Let's do that first. I, I learned my lesson. We're going to do an electrical line. And we're going to do the phone line. Let's extend this out here. Give that to them right now. And what we're going to do is we're going to do... Why... Why do you not want to come here now? Oh, we don't have the money for it. That's, that's unfortunate. Well, you know what? We're just going to have to fast forward and hope that some of these hotel people, when they leave... Are they going to sleep right now? I need you guys to go to sleep. The sooner you go to sleep, the sooner you wake up and make us money. Now we are down. We're actually uh, in the negatives. Over a thousand bucks now, which is not exactly where we want to be. No bueno. Anyways, time is going. These guys should make us at least a thousand bucks. At least a thousand dollars from the, the rent. Or, uh, you know what I mean. The monies from sleeping in our places. Ah, uh, look, they all look nice, sound asleep. Uh, you know, the funny thing is, too, I saw, like, none of these guys really have it, but I have seen it to where they had, like, bottles. Look at this guy's eyes. That's freaky, man. His eyes are red. He looks like the freaking devil. You need to get some more sleep there, buddy. You're not looking so hot. Yeah, look at that. He like threw up all over the wall and everything. That's... I don't know. Not pretty. Alright. So I'm thinking maybe we'll be able to do four, actually. Right? Because one, two, three, four. Little bays right there. Maybe we could do four stores. Not quite sure. Um, did all of our guests check out? They did. So we're only... We only have 109 bucks. That's not good. You know what? I'm going to take out a small little itsy bitsy loan. And I'm gonna put that store in. So let's slow down time. We're gonna put this store in. Uh, I think we want to do. Let's see, 250. Was it the? Was it the drugstore? Yeah, 260 is the highest that I'm seeing right now. Yeah, yeah. We're gonna do. Uh, we're gonna do the drugstore. We're gonna do 260 bucks. And okay, so that yeah, that just takes up one spot. So maybe we will do another store. Let's give it a shot. Let's do one more store. Um, or, you know what, can we do event venues? No. Casino? No. Marquee? No. Hmm. Okay, that's unfortunate. I thought maybe we'd be able to do one of those. Let's just go ahead and do um, the store. Which, I'm already... Here we go. Small store. Uh, we need one more square. One more. Let's do that. Let's do one more square right there. Have that get built. And then we can put down one more store. That's it. Nothing crazy. And let's see. Let's go ahead and extend the utilities too, right? So we're going to do the electrical. We're going to do the phone. Extend that out. And then let's go ahead and decide who we want to move in. Now, 250 is the highest from Bcom Wireless. 250. Uh, okay, we don't want another pharmacy because we already have one. They're just going to compete with each other. Wouldn't make sense now, would it? Especially right next to each other. So let's see. Um, looks like 250 is our winner. So Bcom Wireless, welcome to the store. Or welcome to our hotel slash office building slash casino. Not yet. But that should help us make quite a bit of cash. And you know what I want to do while we do have the money? I am going to want to actually expand. Oh, come on, guys. I'm going to want to expand this over here. And actually, we could have just gone out this way, too. But I am going to expand this over here. And we're going to go all the way out here. And we are going to go all the way out here as well. And once that gets built, we are going to do more hotel rooms because that's where we're making a nice chunk of change. Now we do have to put the uh, the elevator over here, and I do have to remember to put the elevator over there, the service elevator. 
A fellow hotelier has gone bust on his new project. Their loss is your gain as you graciously volunteer to take the excess inventory that was uh, bought for construction. Hotel room construction and HVAC construction will be 50% cheaper for 48 hours. Awesome. That is going to be a huge, huge help for us. Let's go ahead and I'm going to want to put the elevator first. So let's do that. We're going to need the service elevator over here. And then we could go ahead and we could do some of those hotel rooms. So let's see, a tiny studio. No, no, we don't want to do that. Office, no, no. Hotel and event. Here we go. Okay, small hotel rooms. We're going to do something like this. And you know what? We're going to have to... Uh-oh. Yeah, we're going to have to put the little closets down there. Let's go ahead and assign single hotel room, single hotel room. We're going to put these little closets down here before I forget. So we're going to do the wiring closet. And we're going to do, what is that, water, right? We're going to do the water closet. And we're good now. We can do water and electricity throughout the top floor, which is only the third floor. But uh, eventually that's going to be third floor. I want to get to like, what's the most we can do, like 20? Proof of concept, good, we got 600 bucks for that, we can go ahead and cancel that, let's go ahead and speed up time, get a little bit of this cash coming in, because right now we're at negative 616. How much money are you guys generating? Yesterday, made 44 bucks, didn't make anything yesterday. You like being in a high traffic area? Well, you're, you're welcome. Also, like being in high traffic area. Now they're paying us 260. These guys are paying us 250. So that's 510 whopping bucks just from those two stores. And then let's go ahead. Well, we don't have the money right now. Let's go ahead. Every penny that we do get. So we are going to get some nice cash from these guys leaving. I want to say probably close to, let's see, five, a thousand. So we'll probably be at about 1500 in profit. at the end of the day when these guys decide to finally leave. I would like for them to leave sooner. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter. It's not like we can rent one hotel room twice in a day or anything like that. So, you know, not gonna get greedy. But let's go ahead, let's put down some more of these, uh, these rooms. Like that. Bam, bam. And I wanna fill this out as well. And hopefully our, okay, we can't go further out there. Hopefully our housekeeping can actually um, keep up with all this expansion. I'm really hoping they do. Because if, if this works, if we can actually rent all of these rooms out, we're going to be making pretty dang solid money. Pretty dang solid money. Now, let's see here. Now, okay, we completed that contract, but it doesn't look, we can't do anything with it. Uh, we don't want to report no. We need probably we probably need consultants in order to get some of these over here, which we'll maybe try to do that this episode. But there was something I was just thinking there was something that I wanted to get done. What was it? What was it? Mm. We don't need any utilities anywhere. We have our two shops. I don't care about decorating our building right now. Build sub uh, services, no, const no. Oh yeah, contracts, that's right. We wanted to pick up another contract, so more people needed. Uh, increase your building population of 50. I'm not sure, do hotel rooms count for that? Incremental income. Uh, have daily rent revenues of 3,000. We might be able to do that. Let's sign that contract, and we can actually sign another one. Studio apartments bit of variety serves breakfast a place that serves lunch and a place that serves coffee we'll worry about that a little bit later retail uh let's see uh four small stores we only have two right now so i'm not gonna double that up uh valued visitors start a new hotel and they'll help you build it even larger uh that you're a serious hotelier hotelier uh, no, not gonna worry about that. Singletons. 
Starting small option for building hotels, single rooms, also keep guests satisfied by maintaining a hotel rating of at least 75. Building out a sufficient number of single hotel rooms. How many? Let's just go ahead and sign this one. So we've got those two contracts. We have 1400 bucks now. Uh, that being said, we can expand a little bit further, but you know what? Before we do that, I want to make sure that this... Uh, that you guys are going to be able to handle all of our hotel rooms because we did no dinner spots no dinner spots okay it seems like we need a restaurant for dinner spots let's um hmm is that something we can actually do right now i mean i know we can put one down but is it gonna be specifically for dinner let's go ahead and expand this a little bit more oh what do we need here we should I thought we I thought we expanded everything over here. Nope, it doesn't look like it. Okay, so we'll do that. We need water as well. So nobody might use those rooms today just because they weren't connected, although they are now. Which now that they're connected, I would really like for those angry faces to go away. Those aren't those aren't good. So let's see, singletons, nice, nice, nice. Twenty six hundred bucks, cool making a nice chunk of change. Now that being said, we can also expand this one over here. Let's go ahead and also expand the utilities because we can put down another hotel room right there. Let's do, oh, double occupancy hotel room, nice. Let's go ahead and do that. But first, let's put down medium restaurant. Okay, so we're gonna have to make that larger too. Um, so let's see, we wanna go to the edge of this sign over here. So we'll do that, and then let's uh, let's build out this way. We have the cash now. Let's build out, and it skipped this little block right there. And let's go ahead and fast forward time. Maybe we should get one more uh, little construction office because these guys are working really hard. It's just the two construction workers, and we do have quite a bit of construction. We can put down the medium restaurant, so let's put that right there. What are they gonna need? Fast food diners. Can you serve breakfast, lunch, breakfast, lunch, breakfast, lunch? Sorry, guys, I need somebody that can serve dinner. That is very important to me right now. And let's go ahead and slow down time because we're actually 90 bucks, not exactly rolling in the dough right now. Serves lunch, lunch, lunch. I really want ooh, pizza. They should be able to do dinner. Lunch and dinner, lunch and dinner. Beautiful. Pizzeria, who's giving us the most money? Uh, all the same. So let's see, who's got the cooler name? Pizzeria Napoli, uh, Napoli, Napoli, uh, Troya, and Miami style pizza. Hmm, I'm a little, I don't think Miami style pizza is probably any good. So let's go with, let me go with uh, Napoli. They're gonna get put right there. That's gonna make people nice and happy. Let's go ahead and I want to try out, I think I want to try out those double rooms. Can we finally do these? No, still not yet. Okay, so let's do the double occupancy rooms. And, okay, perfect. So that's exactly the size of, why can't we do those? Build cost free, valid placement above ground. Oh, because it's not getting done constructed right there. That's why. Come on guys, start working on this. I need it built over here. Looks like uh, there's no rooms that are... There's no rooms that are dirty, so it looked like housekeeping did handle everything pretty well yesterday. Let's go ahead and put down a couple of the double over here, and let's actually do... Let's do that right there. So now we're gonna have four. So double hotel rooms, we're gonna be getting 169 whopping bucks for each double hotel room. Uh, yep, we need to do the utilities over here. Keep forgetting those, huh? We'll extend that out. We have to do the same over here. And let's do the same thing for water. Hmm. Oh, uh oh, uh oh. Not enough cash. Not enough cash. Oh, no, 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 no. We need to expand. Okay, we need some major money, guys. We need some major money. And hold on. Hold your horses. What's going on here? 
can't function without HVAC hookup? Come on, you can't be serious. Ah, oh boy. Alright, let's see. How are we gonna do this? We're probably... We do have a little bit of room for expansion. We're probably gonna have to build the HVAC over here. And then just go straight up. Let's go ahead and speed up time. Just so we can get some extra cash. I'm thinking of maybe just doing another loan. Because right now we are struggling for cash. You know what, some of these people are going to be leaving though. From our hotel room, so that's going to be bringing us some money. HVAC, really? Oh, we need power too. We expanded a little too quickly. Okay, 1200 bucks. Let's go ahead and slow down time. We are going to build out the, uh, the basement. And we're going to have to do the same thing over here on all of these floors. And we're down to 901 bucks. Okay, hmm. let's go ahead and worry about the the water over here because that restaurant, um, the pizza place, needs water big time. Uh, we're gonna finish connecting this over here, and then we have to worry about that HVAC, which the HVAC is right here. We're gonna need the little plumbing closet, but that's gonna go at the very edge of the map. That's where I'm gonna put that. And then we still need the electricity. We need to expand on that. And where do we have that? It's over here. We can't really destroy this. I really don't want to destroy this uh, copy center, even though we could just move that over a little bit. Um, I'm thinking that's probably what we're going to do. Just move the copy center over here. Or, let's see. If we did the electricity and we did another large one, let's do... Adds 50 electrical, adds 10. So this is, I think, worth the investment. We don't have the cash for it just yet. We might have to do a loan, um, which that is still active. Let's go ahead and accept this, and I might be getting myself in some trouble. We're going to do the electrical over here. Let's go ahead and speed up time. I want to do the HVAC. I have to do the HVAC. We're going to put that over here once they uh, get done constructing this. Like that. Beautiful, beautiful. We need the HVAC closets. We're going to put those at the very top. And then we're going to do the HVAC connections throughout. And we should be good. That should be everything that we need. No, no, no. We still need the electrical. We should be able to service... Okay, that is all connected. It's not... I mean, that is powering through, though. I mean... We should be alright. We have enough electrical. You guys should be getting power. Looks like... Right? Needs your attention. Needs electrical and water pipe hookup. Prefers upper floors. I get that. But we should be fine now. Let's check out this, this by itself, total production, total demand, total, we're only utilizing 30%, so we should be fine. Now, water might be a different case, we, we definitely need another water. Um, so, let's go ahead, we're going to future proof, and we're going to do a bigger water closet. And that right there should, there we go, that fulfilled our needs. These guys are going to be angry, but they're going to be angry for a little while. Nothing really we can do about that. Let's go ahead and do, we're going to need some extra cash. So we're going to do uh, the, the double rooms over here. Bam and bam. I'm not going to worry about anything there. We might, are we going to be, no we can't, we can't squeeze in a, a single over here. Let's slow down time, let's go ahead and do the double rooms over here. And I think we might be good for now. I would really like to see these rooms get rented out. Okay. Oh, wow. We're losing $1,300 a day. That's no good. That's not acceptable, man. At least all the angry faces went away. All the angry faces went away. We are negative. Oh, you know what? That's why. Because of our loans. You know what, though? I think with these rooms all being... Look, we have all of these rooms here. That's three five 
Those didn't get rented out. 3, 5, 7, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 15 rooms got rented out. And why are you not getting electricity and power? Ah, oh, you gotta be kidding me. Alright, we're just gonna go ahead and speed up time. And we should be fine. Once all those people leave their rooms, we should... I'm really hoping we're gonna have the cash necessary to expand the power and water out here. People are leaving the hotel rooms. Negative 1950 bucks right now. Negative 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 7. Come on guys, we need more money. More monies. Okay, everybody left, so that's not good. Oh boy. Well, tomorrow. We're going to have to wait till tomorrow. You know what, guys? That is the end of this episode. If you guys liked the episode, do me a favor. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already for more uh, for more Project High Rise Las Vegas. You've accumulated enough media bus to start a new media campaign. Cool. Uh, I'll worry about that later. You know what, though? I think I am going to pick up a contract real quick that should give us a little bit of cash. Basic offices, studio apartments, variety, valued visitors, two pair. What's this? Uh, yeah, let's do that one. Sign contract. Uh, that gave us a little bit of cash, right? I think so. Uh, no, we didn't get any kind of an advance payment. That sucks. Hmm. Oh, well. So, yeah. If you guys, uh, if you guys like the video and you guys uh, subscribe, it'll let me know that you guys want to see more of the Las Vegas DLC of Project High Rise. And I'll play some more. And like I said in the Sim Airport video, I think I might be cutting back on Sim Airport to every other day. So I'm going to need to fill the other days with a new series, and this just might be it. Now I'm also thinking, I did put up a Twitter poll, and Prison Architect did win for the series that you guys most want to see. So I might be doing a new Prison Architect series, which I'm actually excited about because I haven't played that game in a good probably three or four months and it is one of my all-time favorite games so you know stay tuned that might be coming to the channel anyways hopefully I'll see you guys on another video until then I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you later bye